Hey, this is 47 Mason 47. I was going to give you a quick little how to video on repairing magazines that have dents or uh, sharp creases in them. Now, this is especially common in military surplus or just old rifle magazines. I've got one here. This is the last one that I repaired. I've done this with several AK mags and a couple of other little stick mags like this. This actually goes to uh, PPSH 41. But uh, when I got this, the follower was stuck at this position here where the hole is in the magazine. And uh, there was a, a fairly sharp crease there, and um, I took the, the floor plate off, pulled the spring out, and the follower was still stuck in there, so I took a screwdriver, just pounded it free with a hammer. After that, uh, I took a drill bit that was just big enough for a little screwdriver like this to fit in, and uh, drilled a hole right in the middle of that crease, and then you can take the little screwdriver like this and put it down in there, and then use the, the other side of the magazine kind of as leverage and then just pull up with the screwdriver and it will raise uh, the edges around that dent. And I've done this with dents ranging from about as big as a quarter to this one that was maybe dime sized. And uh, it's always worked great. This one turned out fine. You can take a little file when you're done and smooth the edges out. And then uh, I just put a piece of scotch tape over them. Uh, if you're going to use these heavily, you probably want to either uh, actually take the time to put a weld over it or uh, just put a piece of duct tape over it. That would probably be okay. But anyway, as you can see, the follower is in there. and it, It's fully functional now. I loaded it up just to test and push the rounds out by hand. It worked fine. So uh, if you get a magazine, especially, you know, get a, find a good deal, you buy, you know, five or six AK mags or something, and you look and maybe three of them have dents in them and won't work, this is an easy way to fix that. You know, obviously, if you buy new magazines and they come and get a dent in them, you probably just want to take them back. But uh, yeah, if you buy some surplus or hard to find magazines, kind of like this one, simple way to do it: just drill it out, use a screwdriver, pry it up, and uh, there you go. You'll have a functioning magazine.